I dreaded making a YouTube for God knows how long. Using excuse after excuse just to help me get by. Saying things like, I'm going to start a YouTube this year. Or, in 2024, there's so many people doing YouTube. How can I possibly fit in? Or, how will I ever be able to stand out? Everybody's doing everything. What can I bring new to the table? Or, is people starting with just an iPhone? Yet, here I am with pro-level gear, still scared. But not anymore. What's going on, guys? It's your boy, Yashua Morrison. But you could just call me Yash, you feel me? I'm a cinematographer and photographer. Been in the game professionally for like three years. Even though I've been doing this since like 2016 with just my iPhone, you feel me? If you've been dreading starting a YouTube channel, this video right here is for you. I will discuss why I've been dreading it for the longest time, because God know I've been dragging it since like, you heard the intro. Who is this channel for? And why you should start your own YouTube channel in 2024. And by the end of all of this, I want you to feel inspired to take action, like right now, you feel me? And I want you to know that you're not alone, because there's other creators out there that think just like you. And that's one thing I just found out. But enough of me chatting. I'm about to go hit up this park. It's a nice day out here. You feel me? So I'm about to go see what's going on in the park. Catch some breeze. And I'm going to chat over with y'all when I get there. Let me get dressed. I've been dreading YouTube for multiple reasons. I don't know what to do. Like, it's so many different avenues I could go, so many different pieces of content I could make. And it's just been the struggle for me. I, honestly, I don't know what to make. I want to do short films. I want to do cinematic B-roll shots. I want to do product shots. You know what I mean? Spec ads. It's just my mind just all over the place. And then how I'm going to stand out. It's so many different creators on YouTube right now going crazy. Breaking the internet every single day. And it's like, what can I really bring to the table? What can I do that somebody else didn't do that would, would attract the community that I want to get? You know what I mean? And it's, it's honestly hard. I already feel like I'm behind because it's like people are already doing things that I got to learn. So it's like, damn, when I finally learn it, it's like it's new things coming out. And now I got to relearn those new things. And it's just like keeping up with that pace and just figuring really out how to stand out. It's just crazy. I don't know if you're feeling that. Comment below if you're feeling that. Like... How do we stand out? That's been my, my my second reason. I've been dreading making my YouTube channel. And it's, I don't know, man. Will anybody watch it? You know, I'm, I could spend hours crafting a script, hours storyboarding, hours filming, hours editing, and then post something and nobody watches it, nobody reacts to it. What do I do in those circumstances? You feel me? Like, I've just been trying to think in the future too much. I feel like I literally just been overthinking this whole situation and I just gotta just do it. I be seeing everybody just doing it and I gotta just do it. <laughs> There's no way around that, I gotta do it. I was at a creator event. It was called Let's Ripple. It was hosted by Jeffrey, Film with Colleen, Woe Paulo, and a few other creators that came in show face. And Jeff was saying the same thing. He was nervous about releasing his first film he'd been working on. And he didn't know how it was going to be, how, how, how the fans will react to it. And it was just making him nervous. And then for me, from a standpoint, looking at somebody that inspires me, it's like, damn, I'm not the only one that think this. I'm not alone in the thoughts that I have in my head. It's other creators that's, that's further along than me that's thinking the same damn thoughts. And that's when I knew I just got to start and stop playing. Who's this channel for, you might be asking? This channel is for the people that want to learn anything about filmmaking because anything I learn, I'm teaching. You feel me? I'm not gatekeeping nothing. I'm not hiding nothing. I ain't holding nothing back. You feel me? If I learn it, you gonna learn it. Two, this channel for anyone that want to see cinematic storytelling when I'm just expressing myself in an artistic way. I do that already on Instagram and TikTok, so follow me on there. The link is in the description. You feel me? Make sure you tune into the boy. Three, some short films. I'm gonna do a lot of short films. 
I'm gonna try to do comedy because I was doing comedy back on Facebook in 2016 when I was using just my iPhone, like I mentioned earlier. Um, so I'm gonna try to do some nice short films, some comedy, because that's not what I really see on here. I see a lot of horror, so I wanna change the game up and start doing some comedy short films on YouTube. And then four, I can't do no short films without getting no behind the scenes. So you definitely gotta get the behind the scenes because I know my, me myself, I like to watch a lot of behind the scenes footage. So I'm definitely gonna have that for any short film that I create and try to get some for any other video that I make on this channel. Everybody, and I mean everybody, if you're a filmmaker, anything, content creator, you need a YouTube. YouTube is paying the most money out of every social media platform. So if you want to create and you want your art to turn into dollars, start a YouTube in 2024. I'm not kidding you. You feel me? That's why I'm, I'm mad I hesitated for so long because if I'd have started years ago, my channel would have been somewhere that I wanted it to be by now. I know it would have, because the work that I'm putting in now, I know if I was putting it in five, six years ago, I'd have been up to the build community. And that's one of my other goals of this channel, is to build a community of creators, filmmakers, inspired creators, inspired filmmakers, no matter what you are. I want, I want everybody to be a community on my channel. I want to be able to converse with y'all, talk to y'all, answer questions that y'all may have, help y'all out in any way that I can, start hosting events in the future where we can all get together because I realized the power of events, like I was talking about earlier, the Let's Ripple event, I understand and I realized the power of creator events. It really bring a bunch of people that felt they was alone together and helped them, and helped them realize that they not alone. So that's what I definitely want to do is build a community and that's why you should build a YouTube channel to build that community. It's nothing like a community. And last and foremost, getting paid. Why would you not want to start a YouTube and start getting paid? You can have the financial freedom doing what you love and start getting paid from it. Why not want to start a YouTube channel because of that? That alone made me want to really do it. But the money sometimes is not that much of a motivation. So I understand why that wasn't enough for you to start it. But that's a reason to start it. There's so many pros in starting a YouTube channel in, 20, in 2024. I don't know why I keep jumbling over my words. It's really crazy right now. <laughs> but I ain't script none of this. I wanted this to be from the heart. My first YouTube video that I actually put some thought and effort into, um, I deleted a bunch of old videos that I had. There's a video that I wanted to make it unscripted because I want everything to come from the heart. How I'm feeling, how I'm thinking. And I want to really let you know that you're not alone. <laughs> you feel me? But let's head back to the crib now. You much better be back home so this is the end of the video if you watch it to the end i, I appreciate you a lot i almost still would have put and said agreciate you i almost still would have put and said agreciate you what <laughs> bro what are you talking about man but i appreciate you a lot and thank you for watching i know how youtube favors watch time and if you could like and subscribe to, and like and subscribe to the channel to help get this community thing going. You know what I mean? I want to start building the community as soon as possible. Um, so the only way I could do that is if you join the community. So if you're down, hit that like and subscribe button. I appreciate you. And I'll see you next time. Got to clean up this room. <laughs> I know y'all see this junkie.